don't miss a credit card payment if you're planning on buying a home. Sure, we may not always be great about planning for the future and past mistakes can come back to haunt us, especially when it comes to being sloppy with our credit. The most important factor in calculating your FICO credit score is your payment history. In other words, your ability to make your credit card and car payments on time. This accounts for one third of your score and we all know that when you're getting a mortgage, your credit score is important. It can determine what interest rate you get or if you even qualify at all. Want to know an interesting statistic? It's expected that this year 42 million Americans will have a late payment on their credit card. In other words, they're going to pay late fees and possibly even have a negative strike on their credit report. And it gets even crazier. High income earners are more likely to miss credit card payments than low income earners. In a recent survey by WalletHub of those that will miss a credit card payment will do so because they forgot. It could be that you were traveling or just got busy or maybe lost track of the bill. That's 23 million Americans who will miss a credit card payment for reasons that are totally avoidable. When you're looking to buy a home or refinance in this volatile market, the last thing you want to do is pay a higher interest rate because your credit card, or even worse, have to wait to improve your credit to go through before the transaction. A late payment on a credit card can stay on your credit report for up to seven years. And if you have too many strikes on your credit report, it can make getting your dream home a nightmare and way more difficult than it needs to be and who needs life to be more complicated so we have two tips for you number one you have a smartphone use it put a reminder in your phone 10 days before the due date that way you have plenty of time to send in your payment tip number two is even better go online and make an account with your credit card company and set an automatic payment at the minimum amount that's due by the due date every month this way you know you'll never be late no it's not a great thing to just make the minimum payment but that's not what you're doing you're just making the minimum payment by the due date to make sure that you never have a late mark on your credit. You can go online and make as many payments as you want during that billing cycle because you don't want to get killed with interest or take forever to pay down that balance. Just don't pay late fees or hurt your credit just because you've forgotten or you were traveling or you were unorganized. It is not worth it. Now, if you truly can't afford the payment, don't ignore your bill. Pick up the phone, call your credit card company. Most credit card companies will work with you to come up with a temporary solution, especially if your account is in good standing. We hope this video helps you guard your credit and your credit score. Be sure to get together with the person who sent you this video and get your questions answered. And if you or someone you know is looking to buy, sell, or refinance, make sure and connect with a licensed mortgage professional. As always, thanks for watching. Hi, I'm Lori McMortgage, and I help people buy homes when they don't have the cash to pay for it. If it's your first home, your next home, or your rental home, my team and I will make sure you have the right financing in place and the process is smooth and easy. Thank you so much for watching today. I hope you enjoyed the video and please reach out to us at the information provided. We can't wait to talk to you.